In this episode, we're exploring homes in South Africa, Brazil, and the United States. Welcome back to our channel featuring unique architecture and design homes. Today, we're visiting Falling Water House, designed by Frank Lloyd Wright. In Mill Run, Pennsylvania, in the Bear Run Nature Reserve, where a stream flows at 1,298 feet above sea level and suddenly breaks to fall at 30 feet. Frank Lloyd Wright designed an extraordinary house known as Falling Water that redefined the relationship between man, architecture, and nature. Wright's admiration for Japanese architecture was important in his inspiration for this house along with most of his work. Just like in Japanese architecture, Wright wanted to create harmony between man and nature and his integration of the house with the waterfall was successful in doing so. The house was meant to complement its site while still competing with the drama of the falls and their endless sounds of crashing water. The power of the falls is always felt not visually but through sound as the breaking water could constantly be heard throughout the entire house. Wright revolved the design of the house around the fireplace, the hearth of the home which he considered to be the gathering place for the family. Here a rock cuts into the fireplace, physically bringing in the waterfall into the house. He also brings notice to this concept by dramatically extending the chimney upwards to make it the highest point on the exterior of the house. The house took on a definite masonry form that related to the site and for the terraces they decided on a reinforced concrete structure. The exterior of falling water enforces a strong horizontal panel with the bricks and long terraces. The perfection of these details perfected the house itself even though the house tends to have structural problems that need constant maintenance due to its location. There is no question that Falling Water, now a National Historic Landmark, is a work of genius. From its daring cantilevers to its corner window detail and constant sound of the waterfall, Falling Water is the physical and spiritual occurrence of man and architecture in harmony with nature. All you have to do is listen. Meet the House F, designed by Elphick Prum Architects in South Africa. The site is set below a prominent rocky outcrop on the highest extremity of the reserve, boasting magnificent panoramic view. The two informative features of the siting were an area of flat, disturbed land and dispersion of ingenuous trees. An existing bush track morphs into a paved motor court set around a century-old cabbage tree. The unusual entry follows a processional route down an inconspicuous open staircase into a lower entry court and series of walkways and courtyards. The five bedrooms, living spaces, wine cellar, workspace, gym and sauna are distilled into an arrangement of three simple rectangular pavilions set over two levels a planning assembly that offers a distinctly experiential sequence. The lower two pavilions accommodate living and sleeping, separated the circulation nexus of the house, the pool terrace. The overriding design intention exhibits an entirely African contextual response and architectural disappearance into the landscape. The series of pavilions that fragment to blend into the hillside inform the idea of over horizontality in a stratified topography and precipitate the application of flat roofs. This horizontality promotes a calm visual while several feature elements animate the simple formal assembly introducing focus and surprise. Conceived to amplify the spatial and experiential connection between inside and outside and enhance the location and singularity of the building, Space rather than form and feature becomes the primary idea. 
Responding responsibly to its remote location, sustainability and self-sufficiency are inherent in the design and found in minimal fossil fuel-derived power, an unobtrusive roof plane photovoltaic array and sophisticated Tesla battery. Meet Volcano Refuge, designed by Ruscini Architectura. Located in a prime spot of the Serra da Bocchiana, Brazil, Bocchiano Refuge is a house completely built with structure systems based on wood, mass timber, and wood frame. Besides the concrete slab which supports the house and the piles that bear the wood pillars, the whole project is built of pine wood. The project is composed by three bulks that were denominated as full and empty bulk. The two full bulks at the extremities, lower and more private, host the suite. The region is very cold and with strong winds, therefore, the bedrooms had to be considerably protected with smaller windows and lower ceiling height, promoting coziness and thermal comfort. The empty and central bulk of the house hosts the whole social area of the refuge and should be fully transparent and integrated with the view and the nature. Living room, TV room and kitchen have the ceiling height higher and the wood structure exposed. Large glass panels divide the inside and the outside, integrating or not the great cantilever deck and enhancing the Serra da Bocchiena and the Serra di Mantiquera view in the background of the landscape. Thanks for stopping by. See you in upcoming episodes. Stay tuned. <laughs>